the negation of a statement. So negation. You might hear another word, negation, negative. It might sound like negative to you, right? So negative, so neg negation has something to do with the opposite. And the negation of a statement. So for instance, if this is my hypothesis, and I want to talk about the negation of this, the negation would be not P or not whatever the hypothesis. So think of like making it the opposite of what the original hypothesis was. And we use a symbol like this to represent the not P. So this, if you see something like this, this is saying that this is the negation of the hypothesis and this would be my original hypothesis. So this is the hypothesis. Here's my negation of the hypothesis. So this is the the not P that I'm referring to. So for instance, if I have a, hypo a hypothesis of today is hot, then the negation of this would be today is not hot. So think about whatever you know you're reading. Think about making it the opposite, right? And we and one of the things we talk about in terms of the hypothesis and the conclusion is the truth values, or you know it could be either a true hypothesis or a false one. So if I start with something that let's call it the true truth, you know the true hypothesis, then I'm gonna make it the into a false hypothesis by making it the, sound the opposite. Right, if my true hypothesis was today is hot, then to make it to, into a false, I would say today is not hot. So you're just considering the opposite. Think of it that way. You're making it into a different statement by putting the not into that sentence. So right, today is hot. To negate this, I say today is not hot. To make opposite. All right, so that's what you're doing when you're doing the negation of a statement or a conditional statement.